Hello, I'm Douglas Maddy and welcome to Altered Perceptions. In these videos we're going to be looking at the performances from the TV show Pen and Tellers Fool Us. I'm a magician with over 25 years of experience and I'm going to be watching these episodes alongside various guests so that we can get the perspective from an audience member's point of view as well. I'm Mario Lopez, I come from Spain. I'm a magician, a stupid one, but I have some good tricks. I don't like that when they like a derogatory about themselves. Yeah. I am a magician, I'm a stupid one, but you know, do you know what I mean? It's just sort of like, why, do, why say that? Why, why put yourself, yourself down? Up? Yeah. I'm the best magician in the world. Why, if you're half gonna... decent to get on the show. Exactly. Like... Sell yourself. When I started magic, I started to do card tricks. But when I was 20, I moved to the jungle of Peru. Every day it was raining, and immediately the car like bloop, 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 bloop. I have so many deck of cards. He seems really good, just by watching these little bits that I've seen him do. So he might be lowering your expectations, just yeah. to come in, ah, yeah. you thought of shit, didn't you? I was so happy to discover that the power maybe is not in the car, it's in me. Where did they film that little clip? Like, they're definitely just in the park down the road, aren't they? No, that's Peru. But was it actually Peru? Yeah, yes, it was. I actually checked. Did oh, research. was it? I have no idea. Oh, James is like Tom James. Cruise. He's done the research. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm really gullible. I, I can't say that. things I didn't know like that. Exactly. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, oh. One of my favorite Sorry. What was that R oh, for? Oh, he seems sweet. Does he not seem sweet? I to know, you? but it's like when you say like, "Oh, he's such a nice guy." He's sort of like, so he's not very appealing then. He's sort of like cute and like a little. I mean, do you know what I mean? You, he's not sort of like he don't sort of like he's not attractive then. I mean, that's because of that rat tail thing he's got. I know that that's mean, but I don't like that hair. I can't deal with that. <laughs> it makes me uncomfortable. All right, let's watch the performance. <laughs> <laughs> And I want to share with you one of my favorite tricks, favorite, with salt. It's called the vanishing. The <laughs> my hands are sweaty. <laughs> the, the, the help. But then, I, I, I have this one. That's what I'm saying. Why does he have to do this? Yeah. I don't get it. So this one. Why can't they just come out and just say, here's a good magic yeah. trick and deliver? I have this one. Also this one. <laughs> also I have. So I didn't want to pause it here, but like imagine what? if you go to <laughs> see. I know, I know. This is what I'm saying. This is why magic's got yeah. the thing that it has. Because if you were to go and see a great famous pianist or something, he comes out on stage. He wouldn't sort of like. Why don't you just come out? They come out and just play the piano yeah. or do the orchestra. They don't come out and do all this crap. Like Why do magicians play? <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to play something and then yeah. they play something completely different. Hot oh, cross buns. No, I'm joking. No. <laughs> da, 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 da. Like, why can't they just come out and just do a nice magic trick and go yeah. away and thank you? And you go, oh, that yeah. was lovely. I mean, that kind of girl, that girl was doing it right. She came out. She didn't give a load yeah. of shit. She wasn't doing the nipples. She was just sort of, she came out, polystyrene chair. Here's me doing the thing. Do you know what I mean? Why do, why yeah. do you feel that they have the need yeah. to, to, to make it ridiculous? Yeah. Sorry, I just had a little bit. <laughs> I mean, it was supposed to be me that was getting angry. I know, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a therapy session. <laughs> oh. 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 Ow. No. No. <laughs> <laughs> I like why? that. What? I'm sorry. Okay. I, I don't need to see someone pull their fake nipple off. What makes you think it was fake? That was a fake nipple. I reckon he's going to do a load of stuff here. Let's play, pay attention to see what he's got. I bet he's going to do a load of little tricks. I can use, yeah, I can use the one and will be. Oh. 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 <laughs> it's too many. <laughs> okay, this is not my favorite trick. Uh, do that at the airport. <laughs> <laughs> You know, I get searched without fail every single time I go to an airport. Maybe they fancy you. I think I just look a bit dodgy. Do you? <laughs> She's do. hiding yeah. something. <laughs> <laughs> this is not my favourite trick. Let me let me clean this a little bit. 
Uh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Stop! <laughs> Stop! Stop! <laughs> oh! <laughs> uh, Maybe, maybe it could be worse. Despise him, no, I like it. I, I think it's good like now. It's starting to get good. Yeah. Oh, that's that's interesting. That's interesting. Now we're getting somewhere. Could be worse. Could be sugar. Getting somewhere. <laughs> it's making sense now. It's leaking salt or sugar or cocaine or whatever it is. That's really good. You see, if you just come on and done that, it'd been fine. Thank you. He's pissing salt everywhere. Oh, Loving it. The top that's knitted. <laughs> yeah. Just as a side point. Uh, okay, maybe another day. Uh, oh, I will try to, to do it because today. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh let me. <laughs> okay, I like him. This wasn't personalised for me either, was it? <laughs> Can we talk about your nipple for a second? Oh. <laughs> that was super surprising. Care. Right, I, sh I know I should ask you what you think, but I want to say what I think. Okay. <laughs> because I think he hit the nail on the head of why I don't like that kind of style. It's because it, I don't like clowning. He was yeah. being a clown, not a magician. Yeah. And it's kind of like, it's making the two synonymous. Whereas, like, if he'd have come on and just got a nice bit of music and didn't say too much and just did that route, so yeah. the routine itself was great. Once you got yeah. into the salt going everywhere yeah that was the kind of the core of the routine wasn't it, it yeah. the whole nipple stuff and like, yeah, yeah okay whatever it's kind of like a detraction from that yeah just because you can take your nipple off doesn't mean so that it should <laughs> you definitely shouldn't <laughs> you definitely so shouldn't so if he did just come out and said um and do the little salt gag and then go straight into the salt going everywhere with a bit of music or whatever you want to put on <laughs> so and I think that would have been good, but I don't like the whole idea of this. Why do you have to clown around and sell these jokes? That yeah. that's my gripe. That that's my thing with it. So I just want to feel better now. Thank you for listening to that's me. Fine. It just felt like a therapy session. So anyway, right, cut that bit. And Catherine, what did you think of him? I liked him. I think. Oh, see, I don't know if I liked him more than the other one. I liked him. I think the little comedy bit at the beginning. I didn't enjoy until it started carrying on through, if that makes sense, and then it all tied together. When it was just a couple of things at the beginning, I was like, no, this guy's really cheesy. When, when you say those couple of things at the beginning, what was your feelings about the nipple? I didn't enjoy the nipple. <laughs> <laughs> that was never a sentence I thought I would hear. Yeah. But no, I didn't enjoy the nipple thing. Were you impressed by the nipple? I mean, no. It's tit for tat, really. No. <laughs> <laughs> How long have you been sat with that one? Oh, You've been waiting since the beginning, been sitting haven't on it you? The whole yeah. Time. Yeah, but you, so you weren't. A fan. I thought it was impressive because I've never seen that before. I don't yeah. know how he took his nipple off. It must yeah. be a fake nipple. I would have yeah. thought and took it off and put it back yeah. on again. I haven't as studied opposed, that too as much. As opposed, <laughs> as opposed to the, how would the real nipple come off? Don't the you? real nipple was hidden. <laughs> <laughs> like in the film, now you see me. It went away ten minutes ago before this fake nipple came in. Um, so you weren't a fan of the nipple. So all that larking around at the beginning you did yeah. cut that out because uh, i wasn't a fan of that it either. all makes sense and it all tied together but i agree with you in that it wasn't completely necessary maybe the first like one or two gags mm. with the salt and then just go into the full routine and what did you think of the actual the core of the routine the salt i the really liked it. i liked it too, i actually. really liked I it, it was really good. yeah i thought there was a nice little bit of comedy in that like in itself sort of thing without all the rubbishy bit at the beginning mm. um yeah no but i really enjoyed it and how I do you think like you it. did that like with the salt coming out because it is just to just give it a bit of history it is the salt pour and there's several different ways of doing it and um i like the the way i used to do it is show your hands empty then produce salt show your hand to, and you're always showing your hands yeah. empty whereas he didn't he, he kind of didn't show his hands yeah. empty but the fact that it was coming out all the other yeah. areas and down the sleeve yeah. and out the bottom of the sole of the shoe and stuff and through his trousers yes thank you james <laughs> <laughs> thanks for reminding us about that one i told Nipples you he was and salt. Crotches. yeah so, Underwear. Um, Thank you, James, for picking all of this for me. I don't yeah. pick the first one. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, marks out of ten. You can't go above ten. Thank you. Thank you for that. Well, did you think it was that extraordinary? <laughs> well, I don't know, but we're changing the numbers so dramatically. Right. Right. In case she goes for 10.8 or something. Yeah, it doesn't exist. So, I'd say... 
I'd say the magic in itself, from like layman's eyes, was as impressive as the chair stuff. I think. Oh, you're comparing the but, performances, aren't you? Yeah. That's is good. that? Am I allowed to do that? You can is do that. that. Okay? <laughs> There's <laughs> I no don't rules. Know what's the rules? It's okay. There's no rules. It's just interesting. But it's interesting how you naturally compare one act yeah. to another. That's yeah. interesting. Because so Gary did that as well. Magic wise, for me, obviously not knowing about how they do it or anything about it, I'd say they're pretty much on par. For me, I find them equally as impressive. But I think I probably prefer his performance because of the comedy elements that he put in it. She actually loved the end. comedy then. Yeah, I don't okay. think all of it was necessary, but I did quite like the comedy, as in watching it for entertainment purposes. I'm going to give him a nine. I quite enjoyed that. Oof, that's a whole point. I up. know, I know. I did like it, but then, they, yeah. 9.0 that is sense. that? 9.0. Fucking hell. 9.0. You mean that. That's good, that's good. We got a nine out here, that's good. Yeah. All right, let's Thanks see if this folding. next one will top it out. Huh? Oh yeah, thanks James. Do you think... He for Penn and Teller because I haven't seen that type of salt uh, production before. <laughs> yeah, I have. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I suppose they, as you say, it's quite a reused trick sort of thing. So yeah, like, it's a very they, famous trick. So they'll know different ways the, of doing it. The yeah. basic ways of doing it and how you can then extend that trick, but they may not know. It may have taken so them a few seconds think, to think. Uh, to, to, to make it easy, do you think he would have fooled them? Do you think he'll get the fool no, or reward? I don't think so. You, don't think, so. I don't you think, think they so. know? Yeah. Let's have a look, see if you're right. You are one of the most precise technicians we've ever had on the show. We know how you did a lot of the salt pork. Sure. Maybe you fooled us, maybe you didn't. We sincerely have no idea how. You did the <laughs> nipple. <laughs> we don't. We don't know how you did the nipple. I need to jump in because I think you missed the trick of the nipple. There's it's a slight of nipple. No, 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 it was <laughs> because I think that he had it where his nipple was, and he took the nipple away, but then his real nipple reappeared there. Yes. Right. That's what I thought. That's yeah, but how did, how did it? But it went skin. So what was the skin? Shall we watch it again? Shall we have a look I at the think I missed the nipple. Unfortunately, we're going to have to watch the nipple again. Let's just watch the nipple because again. I think I what missed it a little bit. Twenty-three fifty-eight. Can you F throw it out? Yeah, because you're better at doing the control. I don't know. This be the most editing we've ever done. Over yeah, there. and you you weren't a fan of the nipple, and I said about cutting it out. And yeah, I think maybe I've missed it a little bit. I think we need to look at his tit again. I think I missed a bit of nipple. Yeah. It's a nip slip. Right. I mean, I don't want to lean closer to look. At this guy's nipple. That's a nipple. Right. Now he's moved it up and take, pretended to take it off and put it back on again. He just moved it up. Did you see that? Look, all he's done is... Oh, sorry. <laughs> he's gone like that, right? And then he's literally pulled it up like that, pretended to take it off and put it back down again. Look, tr okay, watch again. again. He li literally... I'm going to get up fucking up now. Right, <laughs> yeah, right back up. Right back up. <laughs> Investigating this. I'm going to... Right. That hand, yeah, this one, moved it up. Oh, right. yeah. yeah. He's got it holding it there, pushes it back right, down. The right hand. Yeah, because he never he never even shows you the nipple. Yeah. His left hand, sorry. Yeah. Look, he moves it up with yeah, his no, left hand. Yeah, no, I agree hand. with Doug. You figured it out. You're smarter than Penn and Teller. See, he's got it in his hand. Yeah. I've the never nipple spent... uh, conclusion is in. <laughs> <laughs> it's slight of nipple. I've never spent so much How time did they not at know someone's that? nipple. All right, okay. Sorry, I'm just... Look, so what you oh is this nipple wasn't it? Sorry, Captain. I mean, I'm not going to try and demo. You. I don't know if it's just. Uh, I, I should have. I should have been working you out with you, and I would this. have a nice six pack. <laughs> but I've got personal training, so he's gone. Actually, do it again because I want to actually try it, see what it looks like on camera, and I'll cut all this out anyway, probably. This is going to be in the video. That's what we were calling. Right, this go on is then. definitely the most green grab. Breathing. <laughs> <laughs> just pull my trousers up a bit. <laughs> Chris will be like, oh, so did you have a good time? <laughs> yeah. I'll be like, you will never guess right. what we got right. up to. Can you do it back a little bit more, please? Just a little bit so I can see exactly what he's doing. Yes, yeah, so he's doing that, yeah. I mean, but can you do that, Doug? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the flute. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So he's going, well la, 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 and then he literally pulls it down, pretend, yeah, so he's going, I don't think the Sound noise is relevant. Needed. It definitely is. So he's is. going like that. It wouldn't work without the noise. He's then coming down, 
going back again and then pretending to pull it off and then just going back that seems to be it I don't know what that looks like on camera did good. you feel the magic happen? I, I did. I, I can see a zoom in. And then, face <laughs> and then milk could spurt out and salt. Oh, no, stop it. <laughs> it, it, it could have run out of salt to come out of his nipple. <laughs> <laughs> if got salt to come out of his nipple, then he would have got a 10.8. I am right, aren't I? Yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. Uh, well done. Thank you, thank you. Guys. Well, I appreciate done. that. I appreciate that. Because I've never seen that before, but it's just basic sleight of hand. Because you'd never actually saw the nipple off. And he just it moved out of the way. I hope that's in your next show. Yeah. <laughs> the next time you perform magic. Unless I'm wrong, unless he actually did take his nipple off. Right, so, sorry, just to wrap that up. So, your final thoughts. So, it was the... Because we haven't actually done our reaction to the... Sorry, but... <sighs> so All that excitement. Out. That'll be like the exorcist. <laughs> I, yeah, yeah, so, um, <laughs> so, oh, sorry, I'm a bit... It's very titillating, isn't it? So, sorry, I got all the... So, um... Yes, yeah, so your thoughts, Catherine, what, was, what were your thoughts on, uh, he, he won with the nipple, with the slight of nipple, so uh, what do you think of Penn and Teller now? Because you thought that they could probably get it <laughs> with the <laughs> slight of nipple. So, so our DVD. about <laughs> nipples. Yeah, it's going to be, uh, when you're stuck in quarantine, slight of nipple, it'll be a trick that we'll teach on the DVD. <laughs> I mean, I'm a little bit disappointed in them now. What, you think they're not as good because they, but oh, it was like... quick. It was we very quick and back. from a distance as yes. well, because they're sat however many feet away. How well can you see a nipple from yeah. like six feet away? Yeah. Uh, just to be fair, if you was like in their shoes now, you did have to look back over the footage yeah. like three times. Yeah, yeah, but when I just to saw it, just to confirm, that's true. Yeah. Yeah. So they, but when I first saw it, I thought, oh, he's just moving out of the way because because it's yeah. basically. But he, sort of he said maybe you did, maybe you didn't, because he could have yeah. done a. F he could have done it. Yeah, because it's because what it is, he's doing on beat, off beat. So that's basic. You can do that with pretty much anything. So he's just doing it with nipple. You can do it. Usually you do it with a coin, not with um, body parts. Body parts. So, yeah, yeah. I'll try it with my bollock <laughs> later on when I'm in bed. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> Look at my bollock balls. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> What's that? That's manipulation balls, yes, isn't it? It is, and I'm going to start twiddling between... Let's, let's get more appropriate. So, <laughs> we need something to, to put on the video. So, all right, we're just having too much fun. <laughs> We've got one more to do. Right, okay, yeah, let's go for the next one. And uh, so, yeah, so you're a bit disappointed because you thought Penn and Teller would have got that, but it yeah, happened but, quick. Yeah. We got to look at it back. Yeah, in the moment, it was very impressive. And then when you have a chance to think about it, watch it back in detail, close up, <laughs> two or three times. On a 65-inch yeah. <laughs> Yes, and I think sometimes they just want... I think sometimes they actually enjoy the performance and they want him to win and yeah. they want to say, oh, well done, because yeah. that was original and that kind of stuff. Yeah. But they can't say, oh, you know, so they're yeah. kind of, he's on the fence about yeah. it. So he's not lying, yeah. but he's like, we'll yeah. give you it anyway. We'll yeah. give you the FU trophy. So are you happy with that? Do you want to change your marking system or are you sticking with no, the mark? Did still... you give him a nine out of ten, didn't you? You did, didn't you? I did yeah. give him a nine. I gave him yeah. a nine. I'm sticking with nine. Nine, and yeah. he did fool them, so that yeah. was a good act. Like then. We're saying that's a good act. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and you'll be notified of our latest videos.